first order I'll tell y'all about that a little bit later my phone keep falling because I'm charging it but once it gets to 100% I'll be able to like take the charger out but also on the clock for Instacart nothing's coming through so I'm just doing DoorDash in the meantime until I get something and then if it gets too busy I'll just cancel the DoorDash but yeah I'm supposed to do Instacart till three it's about 12 30 now so nothing's come through and i've been on since 12. thank you the question is after you pay it through pay for your house are you broke Dash off. It's a really, really easy one. I hopped on it so fast. I think he has like six items or something ridiculous. Okay, so he wants six bananas. I can't kick it for you. None of these look really good. Um, make sure y'all weigh them, and then you'll put how many in the um app, and then. No, this one got like stuff on it. I don't know, y'all. These don't look too good. Okay, got bananas. He wants applesauce. Like, let me tell you how easy this order is. It's literally eight minutes. <laughs> eight minutes. He didn't. I'm like. <laughs> Did you just forget this stuff at the store? And now you want me to come and get it for you? Um, applesauce. I don't think it would be on this aisle, but Publix know they so better than me. I know y'all see that one biggest day. They had some on that aisle, but it was unsweetened. And that's not what he wants. Why they got so much unsweetened? I think this the one. It was so funny. One of my subscribers was like, Unique, I hope you don't stop um doing your day in the lives since you got a new job. Are y'all crazy? I would not do that. I love doing this. The store is so crowded today, y'all. But no, I wouldn't stop showing y'all around when I come do my gigs and stuff. I'm gonna keep doing the gigs because I like doing it. Okay, so he wants some type of raisin bread. Let me see. It's called Canyon Bakehouse Cinnamon Raisin Bread. See, maybe it'll be with these. Do y'all see it? Y'all know I don't see too good up close. <laughs> Canyon Big House. It's bagels. What's that up there? 
Pepperidge Farm, Dave, Sunny, Arnold. Pepperidge Farm. I hope it was not down in like the regular bakery. Am I overlooking it? Okay, so <laughs> I was going down to the aisle because I wanted to check out and it was this lady who works here who oh my gosh y'all I cannot stand going to her aisle and before I could like look up quick enough I was like dang I'm on her aisle and she was like mm -mm, uh -uh, I'm closing you need to go to five he just opened up right there and I was like before I could turn around good enough I just knew like she has the worst customer service ever hate going down her aisle but I didn't realize it until I was like literally down there she's like uh uh you need to go to five because he opened down there I said oh no I'm not about to do this with this lady today but I was like let me just go to a different aisle it's like every time I come here she always got something smart to say but yeah this shouldn't take too long they want me to swipe his debit. Y'all. Y'all will not believe how much money I made for this. Let me show y'all. You see this little bit of stuff right here? Twelve dollars. Twelve dollars. Oh my god, y'all know how Publix always have like little samples and stuff that you can try? Well <laughs> they had brownies today, y'all, and I was like, mmm, brownies. So I got me one. I'd be damned if my tooth don't hurt so bad. This customer was literally around the corner. I feel like she came to the store today and forgot this stuff and made me come and get it. Woo! I gotta tell y'all the story about when I popped the tire trying to get um, around a squirrel. Okay, as soon as I drop the ass off, y'all, I got another one. Gelada. 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 Okay, I'm gonna park down here this time. Oh, somebody came up on my good spot. Oh, what you gonna do, lady? What you gonna do? Is she gonna get it? Yes, yeah, she gonna get it. If she can get it, it won't meant for me. Let me go. I can go down here. There's one. Right across the way that I'm gonna go to. Oh, one opened up right beside her. That is, look, y'all, when you in these parking spots, if you looking at one and the person in front of you get it, it was meant for them. Now, you see how I'm about to just come in here. Let's see. So I came right in. Right there. That Ultima, that's the spot I wanted. Right beside it, I was able to get a parking spot. So I'm excited. <laughs> but yeah, these orders are back to back to back. A bit. Oh, my personality is sticking up. All right. This is gonna be up because she don't look like she wanna lay down. When I finish this order, I gotta go to the bathroom. Okay, guys, so I just finished up in produce. It took about 13 minutes. Now ooh, I'm passing the aisle that I need to go to. <laughs> Walking all fast and talking to y'all. Now I can go up the aisles. This one is supposed to take 44 minutes. I don't think it will, but we'll see, girl. We'll see. You just never know sometimes. <laughs> you just never know. All right, y'all. This is one of my least favorite parts. Okay, I'm looking for ground cumin. Y'all know I don't seem too good up, up close. And it has to be McCormick. Point five ounce or zero point five or something, one point five. Shit, I just want to find the damn thing. We'll worry about the size later. I don't know, y'all. I don't even know what would be a sister flavor to that. This is my least favorite part. So, this is everything. It was pretty simple for the most part. Like, I've had way trickier orders. Let me go down this aisle to get out. But I've had way trickier orders. And 
she whatever changes you made she says she doesn't want to be contacted about changes so you have to use my best judgment with, on what was available so i'm about to head to the checkout now Select debit, your app will tell you about which one, credit or debit, cash back to say no, and your PIN number, it'll be in the app, it's the same PIN number for all of the orders. Big 
car, so hopefully this one is okay. <laughs> Y'all, they was not beeping at me. I know what y'all thinking. They were not beeping at me. <laughs> but I'm about to put this stuff in here. I put these eggs right here for right now so I can get everything else. But yeah, the cash, the cashier that I went to, he was new, so he really didn't know how to do the Instacart stuff. I was patient with him and just giving small talk and stuff. Like, how was your day? How are you liking it? He's like, I am not here for it today. <laughs> I was like, it be like that sometimes. But I say you closer to getting off than when you started. He was like, like, girl, that don't make me feel better. It ain't five o'clock. That's what he was thinking. put my cart back ever 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 because this crog it is is too far where is my car key i'm like i know i opened the trunk so it gotta be a way i can get into my car now all right let's head to this lady house i got a walmart pickup at four 445 so I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do another Instacart. Well I could probably do one more Instacart and then go to Walmart pick up. I don't know, we'll see. We'll see. Let me um GPS to her house and I'll be back. Oh I'm by one of my favorite grocery stores. I haven't been in so long. Y'all they got some really good stuff. Okay y'all I just left from my customer's house and baby, she gave me a $10 tip. I was like, y'all, she had it folded up so nicely. <laughs> and you know, $10 bills have a distinct color. So when I looked down, I was like, this $10. <laughs> I don't know if it's just me, but $10 bills look like they look a little different than your other bills so i was so shocked i come on like mom my customer gave me a ten dollar tip y'all so i don't think i'm gonna get any more for instacart today because my shift's supposed to end at five but i did pick up a walmart pickup at 4 45 so if anything else come in i probably decline it unless it's like something real easy similar to what i had earlier today the one that was like five items for like twelve dollars <laughs> um unless it's one of those i don't plan on picking up another one my friend hit me up and was like i miss you can i see you today i was like yeah i guess but i've been so busy that i just don't really have time for a social life but i think today is gonna be my last day that i actually come and hang out and stuff i think i'm just i'm gonna have to chalk it i'm really gonna have to chalk my social life for a while and just get real tunnel vision about my goals and what i'm trying to achieve because y'all doing these gigs along with having a part-time job like i realize now that it's like a lot but it's just one of those things where i gotta do what i gotta do so yeah <laughs> Me and fun and hanging out is, is not going to be a thing. 
I was looking at my budget last month and no, no. It's taking me way over my numbers to have a social life. Like, I just gotta be out here like, can't do it, can't come, can't hang out. Yeah, this is about to be a wrap. made it home i feel like so worn out from today but um i'm about to take these clothes off get a shower everything like that i was looking in there to see if i wanted something to eat but i'm just gonna ask my friend if we can go and get dinner or something because it's nothing in there that i really want and like i told y'all my digestive system has been a little wonky and yeah it's just it's not getting better i don't know what's wrong with me so like last night in the middle of the night i woke up and i literally puked up everything that i ate yesterday so yeah so i'm just gonna shower and um start getting dressed i have a conference call slash business consulting type mentoring session to do with one of my journeys hey Sade. <laughs> um so that's at seven and i guess i'll hit my friend up and tell her that we can kick it after that so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the vlog for today um if y'all have any questions don't hesitate to ask me in the comment section down below and i'll see you guys tomorrow for another video bye you, you, you.